Is it that time again? It's that time once again. Fan package time, that is. Oh my god. Whoa! Items! Chris Dragon, your package is so big and juicy and meaty. You know how we never get packages from women? Because like, we did, all I would do is be like, oh yeah, those packages are so... Yeah. No, it's always just like... Yeah, it's gotta be phallic. Yeah. <laughs> so this is from uh, our YouTube friend, Chris Dragon. He sent us a crap load of stuff. Uh, I would normally have Chris read this off, but it's very short. It said, hey Matt and Chris and the rest of Team Wee. That's me. Enjoy this mega package of items I've sent to you, which includes candy, chips, and drinks. So you can check out his channel at youtube.com slash Chris Dragon. Thanks, Chris Dragon. Cool name, by link the way. Will, link will be down below. I uh, say uh, we'll read off some of the items first. The first single we'll through is the drinks. And uh, there is one drink we're excluding, but that'll be on a Wii short soon. It's pretty it's bad. It's epic. It's awesome. So I'm keeping that out. Uh, first one we've got here is Tropical Rhythms Pineapple Ginger Drink. And it's a juice. Can you hear that? That's really weird. It sounds like tropical rhythms. Yeah, and next door. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, what's the next one? Uh, next one, I think it'll be cool. Um, sparkling Cranberry Ocean Spray. Um, I know Ocean Spray, it's a pretty big brand, but I've never seen this before. So. Yeah, they started actually carrying these, but in the smaller, like, little, like, lunch cans for kids at the 98 cent store, the ghetto ones. So, yeah. I'm assuming this one's actually still good. Probably good, and probably really good with vodka as well. Now, the other thing we got, we've done Red Rain in the past. It's actually one of the lowest viewed energy drinks I ever I've did. I've never. Uh, this is an awesome name, though. It's Red Rain, and I didn't even know this exists. It's very pomegranate, but they call it Hydroplane. What a cool Whoa. name for an energy drink, right? I didn't even know this. This doesn't exist out here, at least. So, and there's a nice I've, layer I've never heard of Red Rain. Lights, but there you go. Red Rain Hydroplane. Awesome. All right, so... <laughs> Red Rain Hydroplane has got a good ring to it too. <laughs> it does, but it's still, it's a little, it's a little much to say for an energy drink. I would like a Red Rain Hydroplane. <laughs> I would like a Red Hydroplane Rain. Well, which type is that though? Oh, that's the Berry Pomegranate Energy Drink. It's yeah. not like we're getting into the Starbucks territory here. Yeah, so, I'd like a Trenta of Hydroplane Red I, Rain. I still go in there to, and I'll order like a hot chocolate and be like, oh, give me a medium hot chocolate. And they're like, they like correct me. Venti. And I'm just like, no, no medium sounds good. <laughs> I don't Mediano. Need, I, don't, I don't need to vent to you right now. I'm not that angry. So. Yeah. All right, so let's get started under the food portion. Oh, we got. We're gonna do all this in one yes. shot. In all, one shot. One this is why fan packages are so popular. Shot. Hello, Panda. Um, that's the name of it. Yeah, um, it's Hello Panda. It's basically we we've done the uh, chocolate version before, but I didn't even know they made vanilla. Oh, versions. this is gonna be awesome. Yeah, that's the chocolate great. ones are pretty badass. So now we'll be returning. To an old one. Uh, we did a few of these, so I don't know how many of these we'll try. I guess we'll try to go after maybe the sour apple because I don't think we tried that before. I've never. These tried are the that. mini sour dude straws. We did them for a wee shorts. Uh, no, you know what? Not a wee shorts. I'm sorry. A candy of candy is a while back. So. Oh, this looks like fun. Marvel Heroes Gummy Candy Finger Puppets. Yeah, I didn't. That's I've never um, heard of that out here. I, like I didn't know they made candies that goes on your finger. And I want the Hulk because that looks awesome. He's so sexy. Oh, well, Iron Man looks the best, though. Yeah, but Hulk looks sexy. We're going to find out because it never looks as good as no, it does on it the package. It. And then next up is uh, Angelitos. How do you say that? You got me, bro. Malvavicos marshmallows. They're basically uh, strawberry marshmallows. So I think they've got the in their hearts, too. So that's kind of, kind of interesting. I've never seen those out here. Mr. Potato Crisps. Um, it looks like a uh, mayonnaise and ketchup flavor. Oh. Ugh. That's Thanks, not the only Chris one. Dragon. He also set a smaller version, which is the same thing, Mr. Potato Crisp, tomato version. That mayonnaise and ketchup sounds disgusting. It looks like a Mexican Mario. <laughs> yeah, like, get a... <laughs> Where is the princess? I do not care. I'm going to take a nap. <laughs> I'm going to work on the garden. All right, what else we got? Um, oh, ginger mint. Menthes au gingembre. I have no idea where this I is from. I don't know what they are either. Um, it look, they look like uh, little uh, cough drops. I have zero experience with ginger mints. My mom actually bought us some ginger uh, candy snacks uh, for the show, and we just haven't gotten around to doing them yet. So this will be my first experience into the ginger well, territory. Ginger ale is amazing. Yeah, I don't like ginger ale. Ginger ale is amazing. All right, so let's start it off with, uh, let's do some, some marshmallows. Get him oh, down on the mallow. God, this is a lot of mallows. Why would you ever need this much mallows? And in heart form. Maybe um, for strawberry flavored s'mores. Yeah, that could be interesting, I guess. They have Great them at idea. the uh, Basha Market, which is an Arab marketplace. They have a lot of like colorful marshmallows that are really expensive, so I've never bothered. Well, thank you, Chris Dragon. All right, and this one's kind of like a bad example, but they're in heart form. Now, this one's just kind of retarded. 
It's so, kind of a better. Here we go. Cheers. Into strawberry. This is pretty good. I would get sick of those really quick though. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, I don't eat marshmallows every day. So when I was it's younger, been a long time. So my mom would always buy marshmallows to make cookies and stuff, and. Um, I would always grab the bag and I would eat like half the marshmallow bag. And that's why I have a weight problem. <laughs> so yeah, you know, those are those are pretty good. This would probably be very cool with um, Rice Krispie treats. Yeah, because uh, you you know strawberry Rice Krispie yeah, treats. Yeah, that'd be awesome. I bet it's probably uh, pretty expensive though, so I don't know. But You're expensive. I, I like it though. I think it'd be cool with uh, the treats and stuff. I'd give it a 3 out of 5 Matt Face. It's very strawberry-ish. Yeah, I'll give that a, a, a solid 3. The Crumbelievable. Next up, the Mr. Potato Crisps. And these are the tomato Ooh. versions, so we'll save the really gross one for later on. Mr. Potato Tomato I wonder chips. if this is like, uh, is this common over where he lives? Where are you from, Chris Dragon? Eh. Ketchup flavored? Yeah, pretty much. They smell like that. They just look like a regular Lay's chip, though. It smells like a hint of ketchup. Pringles. Uh-huh. Well, it's very tomato -y. Tastes like tomato soup, and I hate tomatoes. Surprisingly not that bad, though. I actually kind of like them. I'm done. Oh, that's not bad. Yeah, at first, tomato soup, but that wears off pretty quickly. I like them. Yeah, those are really good. I three out of five apples. The the grossness goes away after about a second, and it just tastes like a really good uh, like ketchup chip. It's better than the regular ketchup chips I've tried before. So I'm gonna give that a two. The crumbelievable. I don't like tomatoes, but I mean the chip itself was good. Yeah, no, that's pretty interesting. All right, so all right, let's move on to a drink. Sparkling Wash cranberry. That's what I was thinking right now. So, like I said, I have seen these over here just in smaller form. So, I think it's really just ocean spray, but in a fancier looking can to kind of take advantage of the uh, energy drinks. Holy balls, that's great. Oh my god. Yeah, that's ocean spray, but with like, like carbonation in it. Wow, oh, it's really good. I've always liked regular ocean spray cranberry and like their other flavors. Grape I've never really liked too much, but cranberry is really good. That's four out of five because it's, it's pretty damn delicious and the carbonation really adds to it. It gives it an extra little kick. Yeah. Um, I like cranberry juice. Mm -hmm. I'm torn between a four and a five on this. Torn between two lovers. I don't remember the rest of the song. <laughs> um, just because um, I like cranberry juice, I'm, I'm going to give it a five. The Crumbelievable. All right, so uh, we're moving on here. That's pretty, that's pretty epic rating from Andrew. I don't know how many fives you're giving, but I guess yeah, I knew you were eyeing that, and that's why I kept pulling other things because I wanted to hold <laughs> off on it. But I knew the second I gave you free reign, we were going to be finding out these things were. That was <laughs> awesome. All right, so let's find out these marble. Oh my God, they're all oh, Hulk sexy. Wow, there's really only four. <laughs> cheap. No, but that's they're showing you the four uh, on there. Well, I guess they. I mean, these are. They, it's cheap that they only give you four, but these are pretty epic and detailed. Whoa, I'm gonna go with Spider Man because Spider Man looks awesome. These are epic in detail, and it looks like a vagina on the bottom. <laughs> she hulks vagina. I can't even get my finger in this. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> wow, Hulk has such epic detail. His eyes just came off. Okay, look at Spider-Man. <laughs> Hulk flexes like a sexual beast. <laughs> this is pretty awesome. Wow, I can't. Well, Spider-Man. Heavy too. Spider-Man's looking a little retarded. I think these are gonna taste like shit, though. No, oh, no. What's up with the back? So why does mine have like cancer on the back? It's like several <laughs> it's, thoughts. It's his back muscles. Yeah. All right. Um, all right. Well, I, I'm, I'm afraid I'm gonna I'm, bite my finger off. I'm eating his. Yeah, that's not good. I'm eating his his arm. Oh god, I don't like plastic. Are you sure it's edible? Oh yeah. god, it's terrible. Oh my. Oh. No. Oh. Mine wasn't that bad. Oh. Are they different flavors? Oh, it got really gross. It starts off tasting like plastic. Oh, God, no, it kept getting worse. It tasted like... I'm sorry I bit off your arm, Hulk. It didn't even finish it. <laughs> Hulk not care. <laughs> <laughs> God, that was disgusting. Not that bad. Oh, God, it just kept getting more and more plasticky. Oh, Wolverine's pretty badass. Look at that. He's even got his claws. That is awesome. I give him credit for putting his claws on there. Oh, that's pretty f gross, though. I, I gotta give that... I guess a one because I could probably force myself to do it. Uh, but God, that was that got gross quick. No thanks. Yeah, I'm gonna give it a two. The crumbelievable. Let's well get these out of the way. Oh God, ginger. Then we're gonna get the Hello Pandas. This isn't a today. sexy woman on an island either. Oh, okay, well they got cool packaging from Casey Candy. Yours forever. <laughs> Hopefully not that one. Okay, well, it's a hard candy, so that's good. 
Nope. <laughs> oh, no. Ugh. I hate ginger. Nope. Sorry, I'm a little bitch when it comes to ginger. I do not like ginger at all. <laughs> I can see you're not a fan either. You're done with that? Yeah, that was... <laughs> <laughs> that was disgusting. That's wow, one out of five. Yeah, a strong one. The believable. That was disgusting as hell. Oh god, who likes ginger? It's so great. It tastes like old people. Smell. Oh, okay, okay, we need a drink now. Uh, we're gonna go with the Red Rain Hydroplane. God, that was so disgusting. Now I remember liking the original Red Rain quite a bit. It was just really, it was really unique. Uh, Ooh. Whoa! Ooh, Eric would be into this. Hell yeah, he would. <laughs> he got a nice grape flavor. Doesn't smell like grape though, so cheers. Cause it's pomegranate, dummy. Yeah. It's pretty good. Yeah, it's a good pomegranate. You know what's weird about pomegranate is when it's by itself, it tastes amazing. When they try mixing it with things, I always think it ruins the pomegranate taste. Like, I prefer Rockstar Pomegranate because it's just pomegranate. Something like this, it, the berry holds This is definitely more it. berry than pomegranate for mm -hmm. sure. It is. It's, it's really good. It's just, I think the Rockstar Pomegranate is better. And Red Rain and them are like the same price. I don't think Red Rain. It's not big out here. Goldberg's tattoo is on it. <laughs> Stupid. It's <laughs> the first thing I thought when I saw it in the store. I was like, oh, Bill Goldberg's got his own uh, energy drink. Maybe it's endorsed. Uh, it's a good three out of five, though. It's a pretty solid energy drink. It's just no Rockstar Pomegranate, which will be on a map picks one day. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll give it a three. The believable. It was pretty good, but <laughs> yes, it was definitely excellent. more berry than anything. All right, so moving on. Uh, we can get these out of the way because they're stupid. Is the mini sour dudes. Now, again, I've already really had them, and I remember not caring for them that much. Uh, they're totally a Mexican candy. My so. skizzers. All right, well, they've got sour, oh. I'm going to do a sour watermelon. Oh, damn it. All right, so here we go. I, I always like watermelon, it's always good. I'm going to try a whole one. I remember the last one we tried was too, <laughs> it was it was too hard and gross. I remember how they do that cheap thing in the middle to make it look like there's more? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Just like last time, it's not sour at all. Yeah. Where's the, it's called sour dudes. Where's the sour? They're too rough to swallow. They're right. good, but they're hard. No, green isn't sour. God damn it. They're hard and there's no sour. You can never eat that sour. You can never finish them. It's like a two out of five because they're they're doable. But there's no sour though. I don't call yourself sour dudes if you're not gonna be sour. That's really angering to me, and that's why I got not a three and a two because they taste okay. It's just they're a little too hard. They should have made them more gummy-ish, and then it would have been perfect. Sour Punch is like the king of these. This is like a cheap ripoff. Strong two. The unbelievable. Strong two. All right. So moving on on this fan package, we try to keep the, the pace on here a little brisk. Is that what you call it? Brisk? I don't know. Sorry, we're taking a brisk walk through. Brisk fan walk. Line. It's only because there's so much crap, and I don't want them to go on too long. All you guys. And when he like says regardless. crap, he doesn't mean that we're eating your crap. No, we really are, because they send poop. We'll probably have to eat it. All right. So next up is the Hello Panda vanilla cream cookies. I'm excited. Yeah. Well, the chocolate ones are awesome. They're really, really good. Anything? I just gleeped everywhere. Oh, I do it on your old time, too. So. All right. You're a trick. And these look like they're old. <laughs> they expired. They old. Oh, they expired in October. Yep. Yeah, utterly delicious. Not as good as the chocolate ones, though. I know. It's really a four out of five, though. I can't really just... It's just really... It's a cookie with vanilla in it. And it's really, really good. And it's got amazing little, uh, little bear guys on it. I don't know how they do that. Four. It's a strong four. The unbelievable. Let's wash it down with some pineapple and ginger. Yeah. Mr. Potato All chips. All right, chips are up. Gross, gross ass looking chips. The uh, the mayonnaise and tomato. That's so. Why? Ah, it smells like a chip. And it looks like a chip. All right, here we go. It might be a chip. Mr. Tomboto. Oh, you put it in. It's like, oh, it's. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I liked it better than the other ones. I don't even really taste the tomato or the mayonnaise. I mean, initially you kind of taste the mayonnaise a little bit. It's just a regular chip. You taste it? I tasted all of that. Oh no, I don't. Maybe, it, maybe I need another one. <laughs> I can't really taste either thing. I like mayonnaise though. You don't. I don't. Yeah, so that's why I don't think it bothers me. Um, yeah, they got a. That actually made the gag meter go off a little bit. You did. I heard you at the start. I didn't um, understand it because I was doing fine. <laughs> Three out of five. They just taste like regular potato chip, and they're only a dollar twenty-nine. That's actually a pretty good deal. One. The unbelievable. <laughs> All right, 
Well, he just doesn't like mayonnaise. So I can I can understand that. So, all right. So now we're moving on to the last thing, the tropical. Freaking ridiculous. What? How do you say it? Tropical? I thought it was rhymes at first. Rhythms. Alright, rhythms. You idiot? Spoke? You fucking idiot? Oh no, I thought it was... Okay, well, that's my bad. I thought it was a Y and a Y. Alright, so tropical, shut up. Tropical rhythms. This is pineapple <laughs> ginger. The main event of this one. This is gonna be pretty damn gross, so... Alright, this is... Wow. I do not want this oh, at all. Jesus. Pineapple and ginger is not good. I'm the coldest though. Oh, God. Oh, I hate ginger so much. <sighs> yeah, why does it burn your throat? <clears throat> God, it's so gross. If it didn't have the ginger, it'd be really good. That is f***ing disgusting. Ginger That's a is good, homie. One out of five. Yo, this is all yours, hobo. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm gonna give that a one. It wasn't that great. The crumbelievable. I'd rather just give, just give me pineapple juice. Uh-huh. And you don't need to add the ginger. Uh-huh. Oh, my God. Well, well, Chris Dragon. <laughs> Chris Dragon. Yes, thank you for sending in this fan package. As always, we appreciate you guys sending anything in. If you do want to send a package in, just go ahead and send us a message for details on how to do so. And we'll see you tomorrow. Happy birthday! Suck it. No, it was a happy birthday. Don't tell them to suck it. Unless it's the ladies. <laughs>